Hi, it's Tom. Today I'm going to show you a slapped triplet fill in the style of Davey 504. It is the slapped triplet fill that he showed Rob Scallon on Rob Scallon's channel a few months ago. Davey 504 is an extraordinarily good bass guitarist and has managed to create a massive channel and has brought a lot of interest to the bass guitar. In the video on Rob's channel, Davey 504 is showing this exact Marcus Miller type fill, but I have tabbed it out and I'm also going to play through it at a few different speeds. As it's a type of fill that I wasn't very good at, I'll show you a few tips that I found helpful in learning it and I'll break down how you could use it in your own bass lines and hopefully that'll help you out. So if you do find this video helpful and you want more content like this, subscribe. Subscribe now. What? You haven't done it? Do it now. Australian accent reveal at 5,000 subs. Whew. I felt really aggressive. Firstly, with slap, it's important to have the bass set up for slap, and there's three big things here. Strings, first of all, you want to have bright strings, and I have stainless steel strings on this Fender Jazz Bass. Action, I've had this bass set up with low action, with around two millimeters at the 12th fret. And EQ, I have the bass pickup and the overall tone knob turned pretty much almost fully up. You can see that here. And I have cut the mids on my software. So let's walk through the fill. Well, it, so the fill is slap, hammer, pop. So this Davey 504 fill is in the key of E minor. So I find the E on the A string, which is here in the seventh fret. And then from the D string, I go seven, nine, pop, five, seven, pop, five, seven on the A string pop, and then five, seven on the E string and pop. So I go seven, nine, five, seven, five, seven on the A string and then five, seven on the E string. And then I pop that. And then I move, and that's, that's pretty much the whole lick. The, the thing you need to make sure you get as well is get that triplet rhythm. So triplet, 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 triplet. So there's a few things you might struggle with or things that I struggled with. At the full tempo, I found it hard to get that pop sound rather than just kind of like a sloppy kind of dead note. So really want to work on get, hooking that finger under the note and getting the same level of force every time, but you don't want to pull up too much because then you won't be able to get back in time at fast speeds. And you also might find, like I did, that at full speed, being able to get a good slap sound. So what I found is that I worked on... I worked on just doing that without the pop on, on all the strings. And then I added the pop afterwards. Yeah. So let's just say you have a bass line in the key of F sharp minor like this one. <laughs> to transpose a fill, you then need to find the F sharp on the A string, which is here on the ninth fret. So in the key of F sharp, you would then slap nine to 11. 
seven to nine. Seven to nine on the A string, and then seven to nine on the E string. So that same bass line with that fill now sounds like this. So obviously you don't want to use this type of fill too much, but here and there, a fill like this sounds amazing. So I hope you found this useful and do subscribe if you want more content like this. Check me. I, d I don't know what's going on today. This all just feels weird.